And we're back to learning GIMP and this time I'm going to show you how to draw lines. Let us first create a new layer. So I've got a different background and this one I'm going to call it lines. I'm going to have transparent. Click on OK. I'll make sure that I've got it selected and now we're drawing on it. If you see your paintbrush, you can right click on it and you've got all of these different options. Let me first use the paintbrush. You can set the brush right here. For example, I'll use something like this. Left click and drag and you've got this effect. By default it should be like this. And this toolbox gives you the basic drawing tools. If you just left click, you're going to have dots. But if you left click and drag, you've got a line and you can also hold shift and then left click and you've got this function right here. The ink, it's by default a little bit thicker on one end. And again, you can hold shift to have this effect. But what if you want to have horizontally straight lines? Well, the best way to do that in GIMP, as far as I know, is to just drag a guide out of your rulers. Go to view, make sure that snap to guides is active and also show guides so that you can see them. And if you now use one of these tools, let me go back to the pencil tool. And you hover over your guide, you can see that it snaps when you get close to it. Just left click, hold shift, and again it snaps when you get close to it. Click left again, and you've got your straight line. It also works for vertical lines. So again, left click, hold shift, make it snap to the guide, left click again. Let me get rid of the guides and you can see these are perfectly straight lines. There's another tool that you could potentially use, which is the path tool. Let me show you this as well. It's right here. Just select it and again left click. But this time when you hold shift, you're not going to get this indicator line and by default it doesn't have any color attached to it. So if I deselect it, you won't see it anymore. Let me left click again. It's still selected. Then I go to edit and I use stroke path. I have a line width of six and I want to have a solid color. Just confirm via stroke and now you can see it. So this would be also a way to draw a line, but for the most part you want to use these tools like the paintbrush, pencil, airbrush, and in general this is how you can create lines in GIMP. I hope this video was helpful, thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.